What's up, guys? Hey, see you guys later. Oh, Just run!
That's why I fuck your bitch, you fat motherfucker. Westside, bad boy killers, you know. You know who the realest is, niggas, we bring it to <laughs> First off, fuck your bitch in the click you claim. Westside, when we ride, come equipped with game. You claim to be a player, but I fucked your wife. We bust on bad boys, niggas fuck for life. Plus, Puffy trying to see me weak, hearts I rip. Vicky Smalls and Junior Mafia, some mark ass bitches. We keep on coming while we running for your juice. Fucking with 
radio. Little Kim, is you coked up or doped up? Get your little junior wop a click smoked up. What the fuck is you stupid? I take money, crash and mash through Brooklyn. With my click looting, shooting and polluting your block. With 15 shot, cock lock to your knot. Outlaw, mafia click, moving up another notch. In your box top spots, get mopped and dropped. All your fake ass East Coast props, brainstormed and locked. Use a beat biter, a pop style taker. I tell you to your face, you ain't shit but a faker. So for the Alice, with a chaser. About to get murdered for the paper. ED, I mean, approach the scene of the caper. Like a loke, with low season and a choke. Her tone smoke. We ain't no motherfucking joke, dog. Now you tell me who won. I see them, they run. <laughs> they don't want to see us. Whole junior mafia clique dressing up trying to be us. How the fuck they going to be the mob when we always on our job? We millionaires. Killing ain't fair, but somebody got to do it. Oh, yeah, mob deep. <laughs> you want to fuck with us? You little young ass motherfuckers. Don't one of you niggas got sickle cell or something. You fuck with me, nigga. You fuck around, have a seizure or a heart attack. You better back the fuck up before you get smacked the fuck up. It's how we do it on our side. Any of you niggas from New York that want to bring it, bring it. But we ain't singing, we bringing drama. Fuck you and your motherfucking mama. We gonna kill all you motherfuckers. Now, when I came out, I told you it was just about Biggie. Then everybody had to open their mouth with a motherfucker opinion. Well, this how we gonna do this. Fuck Mob Deep. Fuck Biggie. Fuck Bad Boy as a staff, record label, and as a motherfucking crew. And if you want to be down with Bad Boy, then fuck you too. Chino XL, fuck you too. All you motherfuckers, fuck you too. All of y'all motherfuckers, fuck you. Die slow, motherfucker. My phone phone make sure all y'all kids don't grow. You motherfuckers can't be us or see us. We motherfucking thug life riders west side till we die. Out here in California, nigga, we warn you, we'll bomb on you motherfuckers. We do our job. You think you mob, nigga, we the motherfucking mob. Ain't nothing but killers and real niggas, all you motherfuckers. <laughs> That's right. Our shits go triple in four quadruple. You niggas laughing. Big Danny. <laughs> you know how it is when we drop records. Yeah, back. tell him, Tupac. Get him hell. Fuck him. We bad boy kill him. Kill him. What's up, Negative Nation? Welcome to Negs Live. It is 3.35 p.m. Eastern Standard Time here in the beautiful state of Indiana. It is a beautiful, beautiful, beautiful hump day right here in the same spot that I'm in day in and day out. An experiment. I want you to put one in the chat right now. I got to see like what the delay is between us. I got to see what the delay is in between us. So <laughs> what I'm going to do is I'm going to pause myself over here. I don't really feel like looking at myself, but this is all new to me. <clears throat> it's a new platform, but we are advertising it right over here. Check it out. You can stalk me on Instagram at Daddy Negs. You can also check out my Twitch at Negs Live. We're still doing the Twitch thing, baby. We're on Rumble right now at Any Jeezy. It is the uh, dawn of a new beginning. Also, take, check out Patreon. Mr. On the Border. I finally get to use the new layout. Do you love it? Guys, I told you. I told you. So there's about a 30-second delay. Cool. About 20 second delay. I told you guys, I told you guys that I was prepared to be yeeted from YouTube with a moment's notice. I watch a little YouTuber called Salty Cracker. Yeah? Uh, he does a lot of stuff here, and I watch his stuff. It's in Sydney area as hell. It makes me look like a snowflake, so I thought I might be okay here, right? Because uh, YouTube has went too far left. It's, it's too far left. Uh, we got our president out here going, it's the vaccinated versus the unvaccinated. We got uh, hordes of, of people who scream, who oh, racist, attacking people under the guise of racism. It's nuts. So um, I'd much rather be somewhere I can not have to worry every day about my way of life being jeopardized, right? Um, I'm going to be uploading a ton of my videos here. Um... I'm going to be uploading a ton of my videos here. I'm going to be doing a ton of live streams here and on Twitch. This is how we're going to do it. We're going to divide our time up between. Uh, I'm going to do <clears throat> I'm going to do one stream a day here. And I'm going to do one stream a day on Twitch. That's it. I'll bring back. Uh, it's not going to be negative talk radio. It's going to be next live. It's going to be a podcast type thing. I'm going to revamp it a little bit. We're just going to do a podcast. We're going to focus on things that are happening like right now with this cancel culture stuff not just for my own benefit but for the benefit of other people because it's not fair 
It's not fair. Look, it's just money. I don't like being, uh, I don't like having my voice taken away under the guise of identity politics when my identity is the problem to them. So, it's kind of faster here than YouTube. Well, that's because I pay for this. Okay. Um, oh, look at this. Our first one. All hail Negative Nation. All hail Missy007. Yes, guys, you can super chat just like on YouTube. Just like on YouTube. I don't know how to put the uh, notifications from there to here, though. But there is a link in the description if you would like to trigger. I have one animation up. Uh, it's the McMassive GIF. It's Charlie Gold stomping around looking like a Big Mac. So there's a link in the description. You can use PayPal if you'd like to contribute. You will trigger Charlie Gold. I'm going to add more tonight. But I wanted to test run this service, see how it would work. And it was a godsend, let me tell you. Because when I first looked into it very, very, very many, 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 many months ago, it was expensive. And I said, holy Jesus. Holy Jesus, this is expensive. And then I, last night I got hit with both my channels. Boom, boom. It was the only two channels I had monetized too. That's, that's what they went for was the only channels I had monetized. Uh, so I was like, okay, fuck it. I did what I could do last night. Rolled over, went to sleep, woke up, got right to work. Came over here, checked the prices on this, and was like, yo, I can afford this. And then I looked at the upgrade, and I was like, I can afford the upgrade too. Holy Jesus, this is so great. This is so great. This is good stuff. Oh, and by the way, if you do contribute with the link in the description, your name will go up here. I did set that up. So, um, I hear that Twitter is lit. I, I, don't, I don't have a Twitter account. I really, it's a waste of time for me. Uh, especially today, a day like today, I had to make sure that everybody knew where to find me in the meantime until we uh, uh, appeal these strikes. I haven't heard a word from YouTube yet. They very well could be denied, and that's fine. That's fine. If uh, if Hater Nation, or not even Hater Nation, if Charlie fucking Gold uh, feels good about canceling a disabled child's dad's job, making him lose his job then that says everything you need to know about Charlie Gold. This was a race issue. Charlie Gold doesn't like me because I'm white. She doesn't like Chantel because she's white. Okay? Callie doesn't like any white people that don't kiss her ass. It was a race issue of people. I'm not going to sit here and beat that dead horse because it was obvious. It was apparent. And look where we're at now. Okay? That doesn't mean I'm going to go on some, I'm the victim. No, I pick myself up and I continue, baby. I continue. I can entertain right here. Oh, I got off track. For all of you, um, for all of you that are members, for all of you that are members, um, I'm sorry that Charlie Gold, the life of a free spirit, Zachary Michael, and French Fry Girl stole from you. That is what they did. They went to our community and stole from us. And stole from you. I hope that YouTube will refund your money if I don't. Oh, there we go. <laughs> but um, that they did that, okay? They did that because they, they want to play identity politics. Hi, Chuck. How you doing up here on the screen? Told you we wouldn't be behind. See, I could accomplish more under stress than these people can under criticism. Get out of here. Anyway, what we're going to do is I'm going to take... You got, you got to bear with me the next 24 hours. It's going to take me at least from today until tomorrow morning to get everything lined up. I haven't showered today. I haven't done anything. I've ate a little bit. I've put caffeine in my body, and I've been working since 6 o'clock. Nonstop. It's work. It's, I'm not stressing out. I'm not freaking out. I'm not spurging out. It is what it is. I, it is what it is. You know what I'm saying? What can I do? But um, we're, what we're going to do is I'm going to update the Patreon. We're going to start doing uh, panels on StreamYard through Patreon. No big deal. I have a StreamYard account. All we got to do is have a link there, and we could chat and do panels together. That won't be interrupted. It'll just be, if you were a member on YouTube for the for the panels, you'll want to go to my uh, Patreon. That's patreon.com forward slash Mr. On the Border. I'm going to have to, uh, it's, it, there it is right there. There it is. <laughs> so you'll have to go over for that. But um, what we're going to do is we're going to move uh, the members only panels over to Patreon. I don't know, um, what the schedule is going to be like. It's probably going to be similar to, to how it was before Wednesdays and, for, and, and Saturdays. Um, and yeah, that, that's it. And we just, hey, you know what? You know what the best part of this is? You know what the best part is? YouTube's not taking 30 fucking percent of my money now. Thank you. 
Thank you. You go ahead, YouTube. You, you take all these content creators' money, their hard-earned money. You take it. You take 30% of that, and then when they work an entire month, you bow to the woke mob who wants them canceled. That's so appropriate. It's so appropriate. It's ridiculous. Cancel culture is going to blow up in everybody's face one day, and they're going to be like, holy Jesus, what did we do? <clears throat> so... <laughs> But welcome to the new home. Uh, now, look, I, my budget depends on how often. My, my streaming schedule depends on here depends on. Um, it depends on my budget because I have to pay for the service. I'm not a cheapskate. I'm willing to pay for it for entertainment. But I'm going to look into multiple streaming services as well because I would like for. And, oh, and by the way, feel free to clip this and run it over to YouTube. Create a whole ass channel out of it. Go ahead. Okay. Okay. Go ahead, do it. Run over to Twitter, clip it, play it. I don't care. I want you to. Uh, I'm not on those platforms anymore. <laughs> I'm not on those platforms anymore. So uh, gladly put me on those platforms uh, as I sit over here relegated. Uh, not even relegated. Rumble is a great platform. This is where Donald Trump had to come. Yeah. Donald Trump had to come over here because of the same bullshit. Guys, the same ideology got your president run off of YouTube, run off of Facebook, run off of Twitter. And I'm not comparing myself to the president. Fuck that shit. I'm not Trump, right? But it's the same ideology is my point. You feel me? It's the same thing. Same fucking thing. They didn't like the mean words. We, I was impeding somebody's ability to be a bully. <laughs> Cry me a mother truck river. Nobody cares. Nobody cares about your feelings anymore. I, I haven't cared about any of these people's feelings for a long time. Uh, but that's what it boils down to. But I did go over uh, to uh, YouTube. <laughs> By the way, all hail Zestu. All hail Zestu. And I searched my name. <sighs> so I went on Beast Boy's panel earlier. That was uh, a productive conversation. Right? Hang on a second. I got to get the chat up here. I am... Uh... I, I definitely got to have the chat nearby. So let me just get that pulled up. Where the hell did it go? Jesus Christ, where'd it go? There it is. Oh, cool. I can shrink it down just like this. Oh, nice. That's convenient. There we go. So I went over to uh, the U of the tubes, right? Oh, I got to figure out how to get comfortable here. And holy shit. I went on Beast Boy's panel and uh, that was cool. We had a good time, right? We had a good time. I, I adore BX Beast Boy. He allows me to talk about things that other people aren't like quick to condemn you for, which is, I, I might even say that. He's about actual equality. He's about keeping that energy. You know what I'm saying? This dude wouldn't platform me this morning if I was this sinister racist. Okay, I'm not fucking racist. I wish people would quit with that. But that's why we're here on this platform today is because... People like this little lady right here. It's funny that she all of a sudden. <laughs> oh my God, it's so great. We silenced the evil white man. Let's see what you got to say. Hey, Callie, you have no jurisdiction here. Tell, 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 thank everybody for silencing um, the evil white man. The stream is going to be uh, pretty similar. Yeah. Hey, I. Hey, I got all day there, crybaby. I don't have all day, crybaby. Let's get on with it. Let's get on with it. Um, just please pay, pay attention. Um, to my please pay attention to how this woman created a hate mob and ran somebody off of YouTube because of the color of their skin. This lady got exposed for living with rich white people and claiming oppression and racism every day. She literally says she experiences racism every day of her life. I experience racism from her every day of my life and I have a pin message in the chat for you guys. Mm -hmm. So just please respect that. And, um... Oh. Oh, did you need your hug box to be padded? <laughs> just be vigilant. However, if you see anything um, of concern in my chat, feel free to DM me. Um, feel free to let me know. But, um, I mainly just wanted to go live this morning and just say I love you guys, for real. And no, 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 no. I would love a group of people that ran my opposition off the net, too. Yeah. Uh, you didn't run me off the net, off of YouTube. I'd love those people, too. I'd be like, hey, thank you for running that evil white man off the platform. 
Honey, you referred to me as a cisgender white male more times than I could count. I have never referred to you as a, a what what black female in my life. All right. Never have I. Never has that been a point of contention for me. So we are here because of racism. Yours. We're going to continue to argue this narrative. We're going to continue to show that it was the get me out of the way because I befriended Chantel. You can't deal with that, can you? Do you realize? Oh, yeah, it's a miracle. It's a miracle. I guess she thinks that I was going to travel to Hampton County via YouTube. I guess she thought when they took my YouTube account, they took my car keys as well. I don't know. I don't know. And just, um, I really appreciate all you. Like, I love you guys. You are the biggest gaslighting manipulator on that platform. You should be deplatformed today. You should be. You should be deplatformed immediately. And I want you to know that when you removed me from the platform and you celebrated taking food off my family's table, you pissed off thousands of people. And that's not because of me. There's people that don't like me that are mad. Because that's not what we're supposed to do here. That's not what we're supposed to do. I did nothing illegal. You were not threatened. You weren't even mentioned in the song that you flagged me on Twitter over, honey. <coughs> Jesus Christ. Hey, Katie. Hey, uh, D. Hey, look at all the chlamydia coming in. Hey, D. I'm assuming that we can hear and see me okay. Yeah, your, complexion, your complexion's true. Oh, and then you censored Tremoa, too. You censored a black woman. Yeah, you did. You censored a black woman. Somebody who's proud, you know, act, actual proud black woman, right? You know, like, I'm a proud white man. Yeah, I'm, I'm, that's me now. I'm a proud white man. Uh, you, censored, you censored her, too, you and Charlie Gold, who hates being black. Her, her words, right? Her words, right? I'll also continue. Um, I'm a little bit jaded. I'll also continue to because uh, I remember my last live stream. Oh, you no, you're you're. I mean, living in this all rich white community, you are the arbiter of all that is virtuous, honey. Tell us how your cribroids make you the victim. When I have my pin message, I guess it expires after a certain amount of time. Um, yeah. I, will, I will keep that. But um. I just really want to show my love and appreciation for you guys and just say thank you and just say good morning. Hey, Cass. You spent four days. Four days to make me lose my job. That's what you did. You made, you made me lose my job because I'm white. Ca Caledonia Packard of Hampton County of Longmeadow, Massachusetts. Oh, Z <laughs> oh, one, one, oh, six. That's where you live. It's like Beverly Hills. <laughs> it's like musky loaf. Oh, one, one, oh, six, right? Good morning. Hey. I just want to do another chill stream. Um, not only did you make me lose my job, but you made me work for a month, and then you took the paycheck out. No, Callie, you don't have any kids. You took food out of my kid's mouth. You think <clears throat> this is just about me. It's really fucked up you guys are celebrating this because my following and our community is a lot of parents who struggle, actually struggle, not move in with their rich white boyfriend and go, I'm oppressed. Not that type. You know what? I'm sick of your horse shit. Where do you cry at? Because I know you're going to cry. Yeah, there you go. There you go. I'm sorry. Oh, boy, my favorite part. I want to see this. The evil white man's gone. Go tell Steve and Michelle the evil white man's gone. You can rest easy at night. On my community tab, and you guys saw... Um, <laughs> oh, I By the way, they didn't take my car keys, Callie. That's not a threat. I'm, I'm, I'm trying to point out to you that you're a complete fraud. You were scared until they removed my channels? What does that have to do with anything? Why the fuck do you guys paint me as some kind of monster and then go make me lose my job? Fuck with my kid. And then when my channel's removed, you're like, oh, I'm good now. Get the fuck out of here, bitch. We know what you're doing. We know what you're doing. Hey, Zachary Michael. Is it uh, Zachary Michael Sanderson? Yeah, how's it going, big boy? Saw your education. Uh, why can't you hold a job? How many, how many colleges have you been to? Like, have you been taught this identity politics shit your entire life, bro? You cost me my job, dude. You, Zachary Michael Sanderson, cost me my job. <clears throat> and by the way, uh, remember when you were on YouTube, uh, Zach, you said you were taking time off to help the black folk around the time that George Floyd uh, was murdered? <clears throat> you don't live anywhere near the black folk there, Zach. I took a look around your neighborhood. What are you talking about, dude? Why do all of you privileged white people 
think that you're the arbiter of, like you it's disgusting you're the fucking racist you understand that right you think that you have to go defend the poor black folk right they can't defend themselves that's what she perpetuates right that's what she perpetuates zachary michael yeah how would you like it if i waited till you got another job and that dude you don't i mean like I, carthage connorsville 2.75 hours come on bro you know what i'm saying that's not a violent threat chill out chill out and anyway it what if it was i mean if you're gonna go around making people lose their jobs and fuck up with their kids to cover up whatever it is you're doing you know and, oh and and make a, a woman dying woman with cancer's last days as miserable as possible that you should expect for somebody to say something right <clears throat> Let's listen to Crybroids here. She got rid of, hey, Callie, you're not going to cost me a single dime. You know that? Not a single solitary dime. Nope. And all you did, not from me. Hey, look, I'm not trying to double down and do more. Nah. Nah. I don't have to do anything now, but continue doing what I was doing before you guys let your Crybroids get in the way. Now other people are like, oh, shit, what the fuck? Because, hey, there are people that do the same thing I do. They don't want you coming for their channels too. Fuck all that. Hey, if I don't even get reinstated, cool. As long as you don't get to do this again to somebody else, I'm good with it. I can say right now is I love you, and I just hope you know that I mean it. I just hope you know that I mean that. And one day, maybe I'll be able to talk to you all fully. But hey, you know what? My kid didn't even cry like this when his uh, when his mom walked out on him. Yeah. Not even like this. He's a bigger man than this. Yeah. But you, really, you know, it, it, it just goes to show how weak you are. How weak you are. You are were, you were crying to all these people because you cost this child's father his, his job. Now, I have to repeat because I know he could hear part of, what, part of what I'm saying. Maybe he can't. I don't know. If he has questions, he knows he can talk to me. We're very open here about the honest and the, the honest. We're honest and truthful with each other, Callie, because... Uh, you know, I'm not going to abandon my child because of my mental illness. I'm not going to teach her how to, I'm not going to, I've taught him how to be hygienic so he doesn't have problems with his, you know what I'm saying? Like, what the fuck are you doing? You're, you're crying because you make probably one fifth of the money I do and you're living with rich white people and you tried to make me and my son poor. That's not going to work. It will not work. Rowan, you get 100% on here. I guess, <clears throat> I guess, I don't know. I don't know. All hail Rowan. That's awesome. Hell yeah. Uh, this is my first time. I've been monetized on here for a while. I'm not going to step over the line here. There will be no video backups of the streams. No. If you're here for it, you're here for it. That's how we're going to do it. Like I said, things are going to change. This is a minor setback. Yeah, where is Solomon, Ka Callie? Why is it I exposed Frank's pedo shit? I ask you who Solomon, your baby boy, is, and I get booted from the platform. You think we're going to stop asking you where the baby is, Callie? Where's the baby, Callie? Why did you move in with a skinhead communist in a rich white neighborhood to claim you're oppressed every day? Why do you sit like this? Get to this respect, the pin message, and respect my description. Just know that I love you guys so much. Shut the fuck up. Shut the fuck up. Your karma is going to suck, bro. Your karma is going to suck. I fucked you up by giving you that much of what you give Foodie Beauty on the daily. What you give Amberlynn Reed on the daily. Yeah? I'm not here to speak for Foodie Beauty or Amberlynn Reed. Because honestly, at this point, it's been proven beyond the shadow of a doubt. All you care about is race and gender. And the only people that confront and spearhead any kind of campaign against you... Charlie Gold and Zachary Michael, all who deserve to be deplatformed immediately, are Amberlynn Reed and Foodie Beauty. If they don't step up and do something, I mean, like, I don't know what's going to happen. You know, I'm going to keep fighting a good fight because there's you, Laura, Ma there's so many problematic people. Hi, CJ. Hey, CJ, I bet I have more viewers over here on this new platform for my first time than you have on any live stream you do, right? It doesn't mean we're done. It's just, it's just getting good. Hey, right now, all the, all the monies that you guys have given are on hold. All memberships are on hold. I have an appeal in with YouTube. I've been talking with other people who are pulling for me. I, other people are interested in the story because what they did was targeted harassment. It was uh, racism. 
Just because I'm white doesn't mean it wasn't racism. Callie's a fucking racist. Fuck her. And Shane, little commie motherfucker. Right? So we know what we're dealing with now. And it doesn't matter if I've been deplatformed because now you've set me on a new path now. I have every intention now to, I am more, more determined to put people like this on Front Street. If you don't think I won't show up at your Walmart with a microphone and a camera and stick it in your face and hold you accountable like a politician because you want to act like a politician online. You want to have influence like a politician, but you don't want to be held accountable also like a politician. It's fucking crazy. I'm sorry. <clears throat> yeah, you know. What floor are you on? Oh, wait, the, where you live only has two floors. It, it bothered you, me knowing where you live, didn't it? It bothered you, didn't it? How do you think Amberlynn Reed and Foodie Beauty feel every day? When you people call people like Natter, that I don't even know what's going on there. I'm not going to try to flame that situation. But when you insert yourself into people's real lives like you do, well, how do you think they feel? But you act like, no. I'm sorry. They have made new rules, and people have observed those rules. Not a threat. Everything's a threat to them. Unless it's their threat, then it's okay because it happened five minutes ago, right? Charlie Gold, you are in your video and on Twitter bragging, saying, see what I could do when I got the time? You're a confirmed account, Charlie Gold. I think there's some other confirmed accounts out there that would probably take exception to you, not only being lazy about your content, not delivering to your members like you should be, but also going out and false flagging people because they're white. So you could harass a struggling woman. <laughs> idiot. You're an idiot. I'm sorry. I just... I see it. I see it. I see it. It was the wrong color skin. Very and highly understood that I love and I appreciate you guys so much. I personally wouldn't piss on a single person in your community if they were on fire. I wouldn't. Because they fuck with kids, Callie. You fuck with my kids. You did. You and French Fry Girl. And, and, and whatever the fuck. Shane. What, Shannon? Oh, you went to me. He, he dead named. He dead named my boyfriend. Nobody cares. Once you fuck with my kid, I don't have to respect a goddamn thing about you. Is if Shane is supposed to be a man, why isn't he acting like a man? Is what I want to know. Ran to the police because what I, I talked to his auntie. Who down next? Talk to me, auntie. We don't do that here with all of our white privilege. You're going to think I'm going to sit there and let you people preach to me about my white privilege that I do not fucking have while that motherfucker sits there with his white privilege and money? Are you fucking out of your mind, Callie? You're sitting there eating macaroni and cheese, queefing on an old pillow, and just, what, making a hundred bucks uh, 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 every two days? Get the fuck out of That's here. That's just all I can say. That's all I want to hear out of your fucking skanky ass. Get the fuck off my screen. She makes me sick, bruh. She does. She makes me want to fucking vomit. She does. She is absolutely the single most abhorrent person. She is covering for Flanky. Again, hey, I'll sit here and spew it all day long. Crude as fuck on YouTube. C-R-U-D-E-A-F is housing a child groomer. He has not debunked it. It's still happening. That guy is Callie's mod. This all started when I uncovered that, and then I asked her where Solomon was. Where is the baby, Callie? Where's the baby? Where's the baby? Hey, you pushed me into this gonzo journalistic position, right? Yeah? You wanted me to be Hunter S. Thompson. Where's my Coke? It would be a lot more tolerable if I had an eight ball of Coke right now. I just, I just want to tell you that. <laughs> Oh, boy. So, MFW tried to get on the bandwagon. Uh, fuck her as well. Fuck you especially, actually. She tried to get into my DMs. Yes, yes. She was trying to get in my DMs and uh, talk to me. I'm sorry about your channels. I, I saw the first sentence, Kath Catherine, and I blocked you. Go fuck yourself. You didn't apologize for a goddamn thing you did. You are not. Listen, honey, if you think any of my viewers are going to be like, oh, she's a good person now. You got another thing coming. You could redeem yourself, and people still won't fuck with you. You could apologize to me, and I guarantee anybody that's been around all this time, they're going to fuck. They don't, nobody wants to fuck with you. So fuck you, again, using me and my kid and my job and my money and what I do, again, riding my coattails. No. I don't want your boils. I don't want your, your thrush. 
But anyway, much love to BX Beast Boy. Much love to Savage. I'm going to shout these guys out in the chat. I hope, I don't know how it works here. Weed lung is no joke. Hey, get off my ass. It's this cart, man. It's this cart. Carts do that. Carts tear my throat out, yeah? She needs attention for that clout. Ah, she wants some of that clout, don't she? Yeah, it's just a precious little angel. But uh, Sa Savage, much love to Savage. And I'm going to shout out Beast Boy here, too. I'm not shouting out the fucking skanks right here. They can go fuck them fucking cells with soldering iron. Uh, and I, I stand by that. That's why I'm over here now and not on YouTube is because these people push people to the point where you just, you have no, you have no recourse other than to say, go fuck yourself with X, Y, Z. Yeah. So, uh, by the way, that's BX Beast Boy. She needs attention for that class. She's not going to make any money. I hope she knows that. It's not going to, she's not going to net any profits doing that. Man, I keep forgetting that I ate. Where are Callie's fibroids? I don't know, man. Uh, but, you know, I'm going to shout out everybody that I like. By the way, I want to tell the, the Twitter tards, that's not me. I'm not Wendy V, you fucking idiots. You said I have fucking discounted life. You say I'm Wendy V. You, this, you fuckers have established a permanent, like, pattern of mental illness. I had negs and negative reactions. Those are the only two channels you took, so why didn't you take the others if I'm all these other people? I don't understand. <laughs> yeah, oh yeah, it's only when I do the carts, man. I see RSN says my channel's terminated. Let's see what you got to say, you little rapist. How you doing, rape stream news? What's up, buddy? So I've been harassing and threatening everyone. I hope you're going to show some uh, receipts, right? Wow, you got 5,000 views. More people liked it than hated it. Cool. Yeah, they gone. They gone. Look at that. <laughs> By the way, they reported my uh, TikTok. It got me suspended from TikTok till tomorrow as well. But I will be bringing the TikTok back as well because it's going to take the place of my YouTube shorts. You know, maybe it's time I'm just not going to go as hard. I went pretty hard, but you know, new beginnings, baby. New beginnings. What are you doing? You're celebrating this? Bro, you fed liquor to a minor and then came inside of her after she told you no twice. Fuck you. There's nothing I've done that equates to that shit, man. Yeah, you coerced. Yeah, you... Oh, it was coercion. She didn't say she lied. She said it was coercion, bro. You're stretching your... You're fucking twisting your words. You harassed her family until she said it. Yeah. Yeah, you, you know what? I should have looked into it more at the time, and I'm guilty of that from time to time because I am a human being, and sometimes I just need a fucking ally, man, because now look at me. You know, I'm out here. Uh, I don't, I, I'm off YouTube. I've been censored because of, of my, the color of my skin. And here you are celebrating it like a simp. You platformed all those people that helped make this happen. You did. You platformed Ms. Parker, Dragnock, Witty Widow, fucking DC Media Girl, uh, you didn't platform the life of a free spirit because she can't fucking stand you because you're a goddamn rapist. I don't know why DC didn't speak up and say, hey, that's a fuck. I don't know why Callie didn't say, like, what, Callie, why didn't you get mad that he, that, that your friend DC, Roy Orbison, went on platform with, uh, with RSN, but you freaked out over me and Miss Hussey. Oh, by the way, I don't know if Miss Hussey's watching. Is Hussey but Bussy watching by chance? I'm going to say what the fuck I want. They're not going to censor me anymore. It's on. It's on. The, the, the battle for free speech is on. Uh, Miss Hussey, $25 a month. Okay, contact me. I will show you how to have your own live streaming platform for $50 a month. If people like you, they find you entertaining, and they want to hang out with you, it's simple. It's no different than YouTube, and people will support you to do it. You won't need a fucking GoFundMe, none of that horse shit. Just be you, do you, 
email me, I'll help you out, okay? I have no problem helping you out. I'll even, hey, I'll float you the first month to get you started. I have no problem doing that. Yay! 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 Here we go. Yay! Yay! Yeah, I went to a hotel, fed her liquor, sat her down, wanna get it quicker. Name CJ, I laid her down, and she had this perma frown. Wouldn't get off her, wanted some ass, wouldn't get off her, didn't smoke some grass. Went outside to have a smoke, came back in, she said, no, I wanna poke. Came inside her, and then she said, rape, oh my god. I said, great, called her mom, went live on the stream. If you know, if you know what I mean. You just got ether, bitch. I'm already crying. What do you mean I'm already crying? This is crying. This is crying. So you're telling me something that I do that makes me $4,000 a month is taken away from me because of some uh, insecure black girl that lives with a bunch of rich white people? And I, this is crying, CJ? No. No, you raping a girl and then be a mad because I don't want to be your fucking friend, you cuck, you simp, you pussy. Yeah, right? That's crying, you little bitch. <clears throat> yeah. I will not be the only casualty. Do you not think that that didn't set a precedent for other people? CJ, you need to learn what the difference between me being emotionally reactive and me telling you what's going to happen is. That's the truth. I will not be the only casualty. They got Miss Hussy and me and two channels in one day, and we were censored. They've been homophobic to Miss Hussy. They've been a racist to Miss Hussy. Right? So you tell me where I'm wrong, little rapist boy. You going to go stick your finger in the dike? <laughs> yeah, okay, cool. No. No, no. I'm glad you're celebrating. I want you to celebrate. I want you to celebrate. Yeah, chase that clout, CJ. It's all you got, baby. It's all you got. Well, that in your baby hand, right? Oh, we got Brian St. John. Let's go see what this nasty motherfucker is saying. Oh, by the way, I just want to let you all know for your own benefit <clears throat> on YouTube, I guess if uh, like this video right here has been, see, I, that's been suspended. Yeah, it, that my content was a violation of YouTube's terms of service. And they told me on the strikes that I got, it was because I had reacted to content that was also a violation of terms of service or content that was removed from the platform. So Anybody who has clips of me in their video are violating terms of service because I've been suspended from YouTube. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. <laughs> uh, a precedent has been set. And hey, I'm not a... I'm not a... Uh, yeah, Degs did not deserve this perp. Oh, did perp say something? By the way, much love to everybody. Just go search my name, guys. You won't find any videos of mine. You have to go to Rumble. You have to be here in order to watch my content right now. It's temporary. Maybe. And if it's not, baby, we got 300 people here. Uh, he said to call him. I need him to email me his number. Yeah. Uh, I sent him an email earlier. Did, you, did he get it? He must not have gotten it. Fuck. Just uh, just email me, ronpcorbin at gmail.com. Somebody, can somebody get that over to him? I'll call him after the live stream. We'll do that. We'll do that. But Mike, much love to everybody. We got Booger over here coming to bat. What's this? What did Laura say? Uh-oh, yeah. uh Laura. Laura, miss, at least my kids are still alive who just said I was going to do X, Y, Z the other night. Right, Laura? Yeah, you're probably happy about this too. Guess what, Laura? Laura, how many platforms can you jump from? Can you get kicked off of YouTube and go to another platform and have 300 people watching you on your first stream? I'm just curious. I'm not flexing. I'm just curious because that to me says that people must 
be interested in what I'm saying, and I must have some respect, unlike you, with your fucking cotton candy unicorn dick hanging from your fucking rearview mirror, you butt tooth fucking piranha. Nah, he goes. He doesn't go after weak people, though. He goes after me. He goes after Katie. We're not weak. He goes after Foodie Beauty. She's certainly not weak. She'll sit on him. Foodie Beauty's my friend, by the way. You, you, you fucking dumb idiot. You fucking amphetamine abusing burnout. He can kick rocks with no shoes on. Can I kick him in the head with no shoes on? Can you kick me in there? Yeah, come on, come kick me in the head with no shoes on. One free shot. One free shot that I, that I promise. I promise. I, I, <laughs> I promise I will shove you in dog poop. Next deep on Minecraft. Keep diving on foodie. Hey, maybe he likes him. Maybe he likes big fat girls. Wow, really? Really? You're going to say that about Chantel now. You're going to, you're going to trash my friend now. You're going to trash the person who... You know how much fucking harassment we've endured just for having two live streams? We had two fucking live streams together before they shut us down. French fried gunt was allowed to insert herself into Foodie Beauty's life and say, we're not going to react anymore. And then 12 hours later, recant, renege, do a 180, and nobody said a word. You want to tell me that's not mental illness? Oh, and by the way, French fried gunt says, my grandpa was in the mafia. Yeah, my grandpa was in the mafia. No, shut up. So your, your grandfather was in the Jewish mafia, let your... Uh, Middle Eastern boyfriend bludgeoned you for seven years and did nothing, right? But now that you've got a YouTube beef, that's a that's a that's a point of contention. You fucking clown. <laughs> you fucking Canadian clown. You obese fucking God bless America. Do some exercises. Oh, Negs wasn't listed in the obituary? Oh, so he really had nothing to do with him. It's very interesting that you're taking interest in another child, you pedo. You know, you're the lady who took her toddler and put her, put her in a shower with a grown-ass man to see if he'd get an erection. So I, I really appreciate if you didn't talk about other people's children, but Laura, because I, I guarantee that your hard drives contain things that support your lifestyle that you have. Don't, right? Am I not right? Do you not remember platforming your two twins talking about taking a shower together when they were teenagers? Shit like that doesn't happen in a normal household, Laura. It's kind of called incest or something like that. Generally, people nip that in the bud, right? They go, oh, shit, my kids are talking about showering together, and they're in their teens. That's not, I've, I've never had my children ever say that, ever. There was an age where actually, you know, when they're little kids, two or three, you put them in the bath together, right? Save time and save water because you're poor. Kind of like how y'all wanted to make me this time. Yeah, that, but that shit stops around five especially with males and shit. But I don't have any girls, but I guarantee that my male's child and my female child wouldn't be taking a shower together in their teens. How about you guys? Does that sound like normal behavior coming out of a normal, healthy household? No. Really ignore And that, oh, is that the same kid you used as pedo bait, Laura, to see if your boyfriend would become aroused? You fucking weirdo. I have 99% of the time. Yeah. And... He, there was something happening. He said something about my parenting when, like, he couldn't even possibly be as good of a parent as I am. <laughs> and he, uh, he kept going and going and going, and I finally snapped. I'm like, you know what? Uh, At least what? I never lost a kid. Literally, yeah, now, I can't confirm this because he didn't say it to me, but I've been told that he said at one point that, I don't know, something about digging his dead child up. Like, he had no... Um, he had no rights to the child. I apologize to everybody that was offended by it or that was possibly hurt by it, but I did not apologize to him and I will not apologize to him. She's such a tender hearted person. Whoo, so now do you guys see, I, want, I just want you to know something. I'm not here to fuck a sad fish. I'm here to show you the depravity I'm using myself as an example, so if by chance you have to experience something like I did, like one, uh, you guys keep saying my name wasn't listed on the obituary. That's not even a point of contention. If your name's missing some, from something, does that not make somebody your blood, your child? 
Does that not, does that determine your whole? It's weird because you guys take a little something like that. It could have been accidentally left out. You don't fucking know the story, but you take that and you go, oh, that means he was a piece of shit, gave up his rights. It's like you guys just make it up, but you use this to try to de to uh, de disarm me, and it doesn't work anymore. It doesn't work anymore. But I just want you to know that they said you're Cali, cisgender, straight white male deserves everything that's happening to him. And this is where they go to. They're hitting me. This is every day, all day, guys, nonstop. And then you saw how Cali acted after they took the, my job and the income and the food out of, off of my uh, off my table. You see how they acted? You see how they acted, dude? They're fucking jovial. They act like they killed Hitler. Motherfuckers, I'm still here. I'm just not in your little fucking hug box of YouTube anymore. But I guarantee God damn tea that my ass ends up on YouTube. Every clip channel that likes me or hates me, I don't care. I'm, I'm, I'm not going to copyright anybody anymore. I, th I, think we, uh, I think that I've done a lot of damage and shown you that you're not invincible. But let's do this. Every clip channel, clip away. I want you to. I want you to clip away. I want you to promote every live stream. I want you to subscribe. I want you to join my Patreon so you know everything I'm saying. Okay? Because it's going to be good. Exactly, Kimberly. It's fucking weird. Laura's fucking weird. Jesus, you guys are so cool. You guys are so cool. You guys are so cool all over just YouTube stuff. <laughs> oh, Hartley, thank you so much, hon. Thank you for telling everybody to sub to me on Rumble. I told everybody, though, I was like, nuke my channels today. It doesn't mean a goddamn thing. They got me kicked from Twitter not once, not twice, but three times. I said, fuck it the third time. I'm not going back. And guess what? My channel grew. Guys, before they nuked me last night, I had 1,016 viewers. I don't know if they were there flagging the fuck out of me. It seemed like that. I had a weird feeling. I had a weird, weird, weird feeling. But they were also manually reviewing my channel because Yabba, Yabba, she said it was a manual review, so she said she doubts it was a mass flagging. Yabba, you know good goddamn well that was a targeted campaign. I don't know why you just can't call it as it is. You like Charlie Gold that much, yeah. But yeah, but you remember you still fucking dox my mom. I, I mean, we're past that, but you still did that shit. You kind of owe me a solid here, right? Maybe by chance you could just be like, that was fucked up, guys. You shouldn't have done that. Because I, I don't know if you remember, I, my youngest kid is 13, yo. We're Hoosiers, brah. We're Hoosiers. We're fucking, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> we're... <laughs> I don't know. Where's the fucking camaraderie there? I, I, I let go of the doxing of my mother and calling her at her job. You need to tell your friends that they're fucking up. Because if you... I, I don't know what to tell you. I guess wait for videos to drop. Because I'm not on YouTube. I can't make a video. I can't make a video on YouTube. But yeah, but I feel like if you're going to have an opinion on it, maybe it should be a fair one. Like... Maybe I violated terms of service, but what you guys did was fucked up. Because you know Callie's full of shit, Yabs. You called out the gun. Why haven't you called out Callie? She just made me lose my job, Sam. She took my fucking job because she didn't like me exposing her for living with rich white people. Sam, Yabba, we're not rich. We can't relate to the shit. Shane has grown up privileged. I don't understand. Uh, probably because they'll do it to her too. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Well, I guess you got self-preservation. Whatever. Thank God I'm resourceful. Hey, look, I don't hold it against her. If she's trying to, if she's trying to, uh, to uh, practice some self-preservation, I'm not gonna hate on her for that. I'm not, I'm not gonna hate on her for that. Fuck no. She's got kids. I know what it's like. I went hard for my kids. I lost, you know, and and they and they went for my job. So there's that. That's that's on me. That's not on anybody else but Charlie Gold. <laughs> Life of a free spirit. Damn it, Shane. Yeah, French fret girl. Yeah, and Zachary Michael. Zachary Michael, uh, <laughs> I didn't even really dislike you all that much until the cancer thing, you know? I mean, like, I was like, past that, I was trying to see past all that, but then when you start kissing Becky's ass when she came back, because you know you saw a quick meal ticket because you're a fucking leech and a vulture, um, 
I, I knew you were a piece of shit, Zachary Michael. You could fucking shield yourself with a thousand pronouns and be confused about, oh, I have a dick, but I don't know what that makes me. Shut the fuck up. You're a man, but nobody cares if you're gay, but you're a man. You don't need to go around and be like, I don't have a gender. Shut the fuck up. You're in your 30s. You made me lose my job. Now I can't provide for my family if I don't keep, if I don't have a new hustle, right? Yeah. Yeah. How would you like for me to come up to your university, the next job you get, right? And go in there and be like, hey, yo, check out these clips of Zachary Michael encouraging people to get a refund from a dying woman's GoFundMe. Yeah. Everybody want to see that? Turnabout's fair play, Zach. And believe me, I'm going to be watching. I'm going to be watching. So I hope YouTube really kicking off for you. Because I noticed you lost your job in, what, February? Were they downsizing? Were they downsizing? Is that why you wanted Negs gone? Because you need some more of them shekels? Is that what it is? Yeah. Yeah. Hey, I'm not condemning any anybody, but, you know. Hey, I just know. Hey, look, I'm just being honest here. If people can't handle honesty, don't the fuck to tell you. I lost my job today. I'm a little pissed, and I'm allowed to be pissed. So, it's not cool to lose your job. Put a one in the chat if you like losing your job. <laughs> no, I still got a job. I'm an entertainer. That's the beauty of it. I'm just an independent contractor. I just lost my contract with YouTube is what it is. You think they'll, they'll shut Yabba down too? Do something else then. Stop fucking... Leave Chantel the fuck alone. Maybe try that, guys. Maybe try making videos about yourselves. Maybe go on a fucking weight loss journey because I'm telling you what, you know how annoying it is to see all of these unhealthy people judging somebody and laughing at them because they're struggling? It's stupid. Look, bro, you've tried to dehumanize Foodie Beauty for so long that you don't even recognize that she's struggling and it's stupid. And they did the same fucking thing to me in 2017 and 2018. They just dehumanized me because they thought that I did something. MFW and everybody. You think you, you, he'll shut her channel down too? Hey, you know what? I, I just I just lost my whole ass job and the, uh, doing the good fight. There was no way I was going to let Callie. <clears throat> There's no way I was going to let Callie move in with rich white people and try to fuck with me and my kids. What's that happen? I don't give a fuck what race you are, bitch. You've crossed many lines. And I don't know why you think that like they came and took my car keys or something. <laughs> I'm not banned. I'm not banned from Hampton County. It's the United States, Cali. It's not fucking uh, North Korea, and you're not Kim Jong-un. Chill out, bitch. And if anybody's tuning in for the first time, I'm pissed, and rightfully so, and I'm going to use harsh language. I pay good money to do so. Not really good money, but... <laughs> But um, I'm gonna I'm gonna put I'm gonna set up Patreon after the stream. I'm gonna call Isaac and see what the scoop is. Well, I mean, I, I really don't expect her to really give a fuck about my kids because she never did before. So, I mean, the, I'm just glad the other two are adults now. I don't have to worry about that. So I only have one to worry about. So less stress, still stress, but less. Which is really good on a 44-year-old man raising an autistic child, by the way. It really is. It's really super healthy for my heart. Lucky for you guys. Like, I can't believe that they act like this. Because, like, I swear if this... Look how Callie reacted to me getting a hold of Shane's aunt. Did she block you on Facebook, Shane? Did your, did your other relatives block you? She said she didn't really like your dad that much because their views were conflicting. Yeah, I didn't want to. I was gonna hang on to that little morsel until, uh, until, uh, until I got over here. So, what kind of views does your does your dad have, Shane? That that he and his sister don't speak. Hmm? Does that explain the shaved head and this in the pictures? Is that is that what that is? Let me tell you something. Would you, do you fancy yourself as what, like a white nationalist, white supremacist maybe? Which is it? Skinhead doing this intentionally in a picture? What ideologies does your daddy have? Is he a liberal? Or is he a far right-leaning, God-fearing conservative? Which is it? 
And where's your girlfriend's baby? Where's Callie's baby, Solomon? You know what I'm talking about. She knows what I'm talking about. She can't silence me now. That's the biggest question. Is why are they trying to silence people who are asking these questions? Yeah? Why, why are they trying to silence people who are asking these questions? Where are you hiding, Callie? Where's the baby? I shared the tweet. You put emojis of the baby. You said baby time. Bonding with my baby boy. Baby, baby, baby. You used the word baby three or four times and like six baby emojis. Yeah. You sure did. <sighs> Solomon is his name. Uh -huh. Yeah, where's your dad, Callie? Where's your dad? Do I, do, do I need to start calling nursing homes? I told you, I'm, a, I'm an investigative gonzo journalist. If you don't want me to be a part of your story, stop making me part of it. I'm investigating you now because you have some more skeletons that I am very interested in. I want to know where this baby is. I want to know where Mr. Packard is. Is he in a home? Did you abandon him in an apartment? He was disabled, correct? Yes, Kelly has a child. She posted as much on her Twitter for attention. So, yes. Yes. I want to know where the child's at. It would be what, 10? Was that 2012? So would what, the baby be nine? Nine years old? Where, where's Solomon, Callie? What are you hiding? This woman has got secrets. They don't want me telling them on uh, YouTube. They don't. This is some Epstein level shit. Money involved, influence involved. Yeah, I'm not bullshitting you. Just go look what Shane's dad does for a living. Mm -hmm. We're allowed to talk about that, by the way, Shane and Callie. We are allowed to talk about that because it was public or record. How else did I get it if it wasn't public record, Shane? Uh, you didn't see the tweet about, fuck, let me see if I can find it. I don't know, man. I'll see. I mean, I, I'm bad at organization. I just, I, I'm, I, yeah, I'm just kind of a mouthpiece, fighting a good fight here. But I'll find it. Let me just give me a second. Let's see if I can find it here. Holy fuck! Holy fuck! Where's your, where's your folder at? Holy Jesus! You tweet so much, honey. She tweeted at Leafy. I don't know how many hundreds of times. I don't know how many hundreds of times. I'm gonna find it here real quick. Give me just a second. Um, there's the French fight girls. I'm not a hater. I'm an anti anti fucking retard. Uh, your shitty OnlyFans. Where's it at? Where are you at, baby girl? Where's where's it at? I want to see it. Shit. That's the wrong folder. Uh, I mean a lot of, a lot of uh. Well, yeah, somebody needs to find out where that kid's at because she's got some shit that she needs to... I mean, like, chickens are coming home to roost. I don't care. She doesn't get to hide behind a rich white privilege and then make me lose my job. She just made it worse. She just made it worse. I, I mean, I, she, she's going to be investigated because she cost me money. I don't think people understand that. This isn't just a hobby to me. It's a way of life. And I'm going to be fine. I, I'm not even sweating that. Money's going to be fine. I don't like being silenced. I want my platform. I want my platform back. That's what I want. Is my platform back, Shane? I want my platform back, Shane, you little bigot. You rich little motherfucker. That's right, cocksucker. I can't look at my... I don't know what's in this folder, so I gotta be careful because uh, I don't think there's in a... Oh, look at, look at you here, Callie. Look at that. Look at Callie. I'm in the mood to kill a bitch. She's in the mood to kill a bitch. Don't fuck with me, cunt. I guarantee that you bitches will die one way or another. So yeah, they got the right person, right? They got the right person's channel, correct? It was 2017. Okay. Uh, yeah. You're going to kill a bitch, huh, Cali? Get your screenshots, guys. This shit's important because they they removed me because I called Shane's auntie. 
hey man, somebody called me a pedo the other day. I went to them under my real name and said, don't fucking call me a pedo. I don't even know who you are. I was like, keep my fucking name out of your mouth. That's all I said, and I blocked them. The end. Don't do it. I will talk to you in person. There's no laws against that. I have every right to defend my reputation that I have created. Callie, you don't get to ruin my reputation and post shit like this. You know what I'm saying? What the fuck? Ugh. Jesus Christ. Hang on, we're gonna, we're gonna get there. Here you go, French fry girl. Hey, Frank, this is how you debunk something. Oh, who's this? Oh, yeah. yeah. 49 year old Ronald Corbin. What did he do? Oh, yeah. He was the gunman who robbed the German American bank in Tell City back in July. Uh, Tell City is in Indiana. Yeah. I don't know. Is that me? Is that me? I don't know. Is, is, is it me? I don't know. I don't remember robbing a bank at 49 years old. Since I'm only 44. This asshole's the reason I had to write the FBI. Because of you assholes on the internet. Thank you for that too. <sighs> trying to disarm me. Trying to silence me. I'm not happy. Really not happy. I'm not happy at all. Oh, here's the girl that called me a pedo that I contacted. Isn't that right, sweetheart? There's you and your pedo stash boy. What the fuck is wrong with your head here and your fucking eyebrows? You look ridiculous. Do any of your parents love you? Jesus fucking Christ. What is going on here? Oh, yeah, here's where you said it, just for posterity purposes. There you go. By the way, you can fuck yourself. If you accuse somebody of being a pedo, you deserve to have your name out there because you're dangerous. You're going to get somebody killed. You're going to make people lose their job. All right, here's the uh, account that uh, French Fry Girl made with uh, using my son. It says Ronald's Angel. Yeah, that was super cool of her. Uh, she It was confirmed that this was her. So that was that was super awesome of Hater Nation to do that before they made me lose my job. Oh, here's Shane throwing up the old, you know, you know that, that right there. See that right there? I mean, that, that's that's it's you, right, Shane? Right, edgy, edge lord. You look like you, you you look less like you, you look like you have full blown AIDS now, but you do. Your girlfriend is full blown AIDS. Uh, but what's this? What's this, Shane? Here you go. Get your screenshots. Have fun with it. Meme it up. I'm here for a little bit longer. I'm here for a little bit longer. Then I'm going to take it easy the rest of the night. I'm going to play some video games maybe. I don't know. I might go to the park and feed the squirrels. Who knows what I'm going to do? Who knows what I'm going to do? Hang on a second here. Let me make sure that we're not going to run into any penis territory. I don't think there's any penis pics in here. I don't think so anyway. No? No? Good. Good. Good, because I just want to scroll through these. I just want to scroll through. You know, I'm still. Let's just let's just go through. Uh, oh, oh, there it is. There we go. There you go. So, what are you doing, Shane? You trolling or you trolling? What are you doing there, buddy? There are two screen symbols. Oh, you're not talking to me. So, okay. Yeah. All right, Shane, 2017. That's super cool of you, buddy. Uh, I appreciate you making me lose my job while you're stirring mashed potatoes with all, for all the rich white people. He came back? What, he came back in your mouth or what? Vaping equals kill yourself. She still has a platform. She still has a platform. She does. She's been making violent threats for years. She's been making violent threats. Violent ass motherfucking threats for years. I never made one violent threat to her. I wrote a song where she wasn't mentioned and she made me lose my job over it. Here's her appropriating, I guess what she thinks is appropriating culture, which is really just a fucking insult considering where she's at and how she's living now. She doesn't live in a ghetto. She doesn't live in a fucking ghetto, bro. Look at this, look at this fucking clown. 
She just like thought, just thought she was appropriating something. It's a fuck. What are you talking about? If you were a comedian, I, sure, ha ha ha. I think it's a very important that we still have social commentary because it allows us to have calm conversations about things. That's why comedians are fucking important, guys. If we cancel comedy, we're done talking. We're snitching on each other now. What did Charlie Gold and Callie do? They snitched on me because I'm white. That's fucked up. Yeah. Anyway. Yeah. When was the last time you looked like that? Look, you got drag knock teeth. Look at that fucking drag knock teeth. What the fuck? You got drag knock boobs too? Learn how to take it easy, huh? Can you guys see that all right? Can you see that all right? Uh, I almost fell for it again. Yeah, anyway, I want to find the Solomon. If one more hate comment, more violent threats from Callie. Yeah. Um, oh, there's the Gunch Cheap Motel, or maybe not. Who knows? Who cares? She gave me a P.O. box. That's all I got. Uh, oh, yeah, here's her uh, shouting Jeffree Star out. She don't care what the press is talking about, like the racism. She wants those swatches. Yeah, ghetto is seen as a bad term by the fake woke SJWs, but, you know, what are you going to do? What are you going to do? Dude, they're, she's a racist. Callie's a fucking racist. I, I've never, I have never encountered such a racist individual in my life. Charlie Gold slandered me last night and said I was a bigot. That is not true, Charlie Gold. You know that. By the way, I can't wait to go visit my friend in Clearwater. Where's the Solomon tweet? I don't care about your horse. I'm fine. Nobody cares. You're not fine. Overwhelmed, huh? Kill Keemstar. Wow, look at that. Look at that. Holy shit. Yeah, we're going back in time a little bit. We've done this before, but we have to do it here now because we've been booted off of YouTube. So we kind of have to go over all the bullshit again. Yeah, we're probably going to have a watch session sometime this week where we go over to Discounted Life and just, I'm just going to let the videos play with no commentary. I'm just going to chill and vibe while we watch the videos. Uh, or maybe I'll just download them and upload them here. I don't know. I don't know. We'll figure it out. Kill Keemstar, huh? Cool. Where's the Solomon tweet? I want to see that. Uh, look at you rusty, dusty... Ashy old fucking nappy wig and um, blah blah blah. My life slowed. Yeah, we wish. Where's the Solomon tweet? I know it's in here. Oh, by the way, French Fry Girl has a criminal record, or she was caught stealing from a, or not really a criminal record, but she was caught stealing from a drug mart. I have her name and, and, and P.O. box, but if it's fake, I turn it over to YouTube, and if they find out it's fake, she's probably going to get a strike. Uh, oh, here's Callie. Uh, Uninviting the black chick and inviting the white girl to the cookout because that's Cali for you. Oh, Jesus Christ. Oh, my God. Yeah, it's appropriate. Crazy broad. You feel like you're getting your life back? Pfft, unfortunately. Happy your mom enjoyed her Mother's Day, huh? Oh, I bet you miss her, don't you? You know? Oh, shut up, Frenchie. Where's the fucking Solomon? Oh, there it is. There it is. Now, when you look at this, tell me, what do you what do you see? Do you see somebody that's talking about spending time with a boyfriend? Or do you see somebody that is telling everybody that they're, that they're signaling to everybody that they're spending time with their child, right? This is on Twitter. I don't care if people. I don't care what people do. If people want to flag, flag away. I don't give a fuck. I don't give a fuck anymore. You think I care? If, you think I care if Charlie Gold is broke and destitute? You think I give a fuck if Callie has to leech, has to eventually start fucking Shane's daddy in order to fucking pay for her pizza rolls? I don't give a fuck. Fuck all of them. I look forward to the day where I read an article about where how they had to go in and scrape DC media off of her fucking pleather couch because she laid there for three days because nobody gives a fuck about her. Dogs fucking eating her fingers off and shit. That's a little morbid. I'm sorry. There's a little morsel for you. Go victimize yourself with that. This is the only tweet I was looking for. So tell me, what do you see? Hashtag. Okay, baby emoji three times. All hashtag bonding with my baby today. 
exclamation point twice. Me and Solomon, exclamation point, hashtag baby time, exclamation point three times, hashtag fun times, hashtag baby boy, XOXOXOXO, baby emoji, baby emoji, baby emoji, heart, 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 music, music, kiss, 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 heart, 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 Instagram. The Instagram link is invalid. It's gone. There is a picture. There is a picture, and it's gone. There was a picture of her kid. I'm going to go back in the Wayback Machine and see if I can't find it with that link. But if people didn't index it, maybe not. Because people usually only index things that are, you know, viral or whatever. So, no, my pants are eating my, <laughs> my pants are eating my butt. Yeah. <laughs> Y'all are crazy. Yeah, so th if I posted this, you guys would think I was talking about my kid, correct? Yeah, this is me talking about bonding with my child. I did, Missy. I fucking did. I did. <laughs> I want to know where the baby's at. I'm going to dig a little deeper today. I didn't dig deep enough. I got really super excited when I found out that Shane was fucking rich and privileged. And I didn't dig into Callie because I know she's poor trash. And she's white. Fuck me! Holy shit! Auntie M with the $50 and Charlie Gold stomping across the screen. That scared the fuck out of me. Holy Jesus. Holy Jesus. Anyway. What a day, guys. What a fucking day. But, uh, you know, I, I feel, you know what? I was talking to Missy earlier and I said, uh, you know, I said, it's very odd. I was like, they took my job. They took your job. And uh, I was like, I'm, and, I, and I, I'm not okay with it. I'm just pissed that they fucking took my job, man. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? It's not about the money. The money could be made elsewhere, baby. I, I'm not going to go hungry. That's never going to happen. Get, nice try. Nice try fucking with the disabled kid. You guys are awesome. Totally not sadist. Totally not sadist and borderline pedos. Uh, however, um, I don't know what I was going to say. Anyway, um, I was relieved, if you will. Okay, I was, I, I told Missy, I said, look, I'm, I feel like I'm kind of relieved. It's like, and she, she kind of said, you know, it's because the, the, the war is, it feels like the war is over. Because now I feel like more people have seen what was going on and people see what happened to me. It was like a sacrifice, like a casualty of war. I'm good with that. I'm good with that. Dude, I'm good with not ever going back to YouTube ever again because this opens up a world of possibility. This is going to help my creativity. This isn't a hindrance. This is going to help my creativity because now I have to be better than I was because I don't have access to the audience like I did. Well, I don't know how many people are here. Holy Jesus, 327? Really? Holy smokes. Thanks, you guys. Thank you. Be sure you sub. Did the stream freeze for you? Okay, I'm going to go over here and make sure because I've never done this before. I need to check my data because I have to pay for data on this motherfucker. This shit ain't free. This ain't on YouTube's dime anymore. This is on your boy's dime now. Oh, come on now. Where's that? God damn it. My content earnings account overview. Hey, there's the super chats. Five dollars sixty cents. Cool. Uh, did it freeze for anybody? Uh, they cheated and grouped together. I don't play those games. I didn't try to do that to them. I didn't try to have Charlie Gold shut down, but I absolutely one hundred percent support. Holy shit! Straws, damn y'all! It's like I never left YouTube. Told you. All hail Straubs, all hail Straubs, all hail Auntie M, all hail Zest 2. I'll have to fix that. I don't know why it's only showing four people. Guys, I'm going to get everything worked out. Uh, I got this new layout. Things are good. I mean, really, they, they just really just, they, they canceled me on YouTube, but now I have to go over here. It, like this, I've had this planned is what I'm trying to say. I've had all this planned. I've paid for all these designs. I've paid for the space. I've, you know what I'm saying? I've paid. Greatly. I've paid dearly, really. 
So they didn't listen. He's bluffing. We'll get him shut down. Dude, they are actively, motherfucking actively trying to shut down my Discord server. Actively trying to shut down my Discord server. Becky, remember Becky? Remember that bitch Becky who went to January 6th and was all badass about it? I don't give a fuck about no liberals. Fuck Joe Biden. Fuck Democrats. Fuck them. Oh, she has a criminal record for uh, forgery, she claims. She claims. She also claims that she also said that she wished she could have taken a gun to January 6th. Why would she have needed a gun at January 6th, guys? Why is that, that bitch Becky? Now she's hanging out with a flanky... And the, the, the kid, you know, over there playing patty cake with kids' cheeks and shit in VR chats. She literally went from be, playing big-ass MAGA bitch to peddling and placating these, the, these far-left libtards. It's unfucking believable It was an unbelievable transition that she made. She's a complete fucking fraud. She'll, she's not a Republican. She is not a conservative. She is a fucking sheep, a wolf in sheep's clothing, and she should be avoided at all costs. She thought because she came in this community and gave me a few shekels, she could boss me around. Hey, bitch, I had so many complaints on you. I, I ignored at least 10 complaints about you before eventually you saw yourself out. You saw yourself out. So why don't you... You're, thanks for the nudes. Appreciate it. But uh, I'm not going to dump them. Don't worry. I'm going to still use them. But, you know, I mean, it's not going to happen. I'm sorry I didn't fuck you. Stop acting like this. Goddamn. Uh, Silvana, yeah, I said that just a few minutes ago. I'm going to fix it. There's going to be more super chat lines. Yes, it's not even for the super chats on there. It's for the uh, link to stream Streamlabs in the description. Yeah, I mean, like, even if I get my channels back, all I'm going to do is, uh, if I stream here, I'll just mirror it on YouTube, and then if they take my job again, then fuck it. I mean, we're, I'm really just tra this is what I'm doing. Uh, let me pull this up for you. Let me pull this up for you there. My oh, God damn it! Freaking dyslexia. Why can't... Just go to the goddamn place. I don't care. Look at how much money I'm making. It's not that much. Uh, fuck! Where'd it go? God damn it! There it is. There we go. Uh... We're going to start doing the, all the members, all the members only stuff we were doing on YouTube. We're going to go straight through Patreon. Patreon's not going to be used to talk shit and all that. It's going to be strictly used to update you guys on exclusive perks for VIPs. You know, that's, I'm going to go over there and retool. It's going to take, like I said, it's going to take me a while to get, not a while, but a couple days to get everything tooled. Like I have to redesign images. I have to, I, I, this is a reboot for me, but I have a good start. So I'm super happy for that. You know, I got, I don't have to worry about money. I got money in the bank. So I, I got, I got breathing room to reboot, kind of reformat, uh, go back to the drawing board. So, uh, what we're going to do, there's a five, there's a $1, $5 and $10 tier. What I'm, excuse me. What I'm going to do is for the $5 and $10 tiers, there's those, you'll have access to the members only events. $1 is just, if you just want to contribute, you want to help out, just contribute a dollar. It comes out every month. No big deal. But five dollars, ten dollars will be. We'll have the members only perks and for the members only panels, and they'll be on Streamyards just like before. Nothing's really changing. Just no YouTube anymore. That's it. Finito. Yeah, YouTube's not getting my money now. So even, check it out. <laughs> let's say I get, let's say I get a thousand dollars of super chats on YouTube, right? YouTube takes three hundred dollars. I only get seven. Let's say I get. Uh, over here, somebody sends a thousand dollars via PayPal, and they get their name up here. Cool, yeah. Same thing as super chats and all that shit, right? Uh, I get over nine hundred dollars of that after fees and stuff, right? Way over nine hundred dollars. So yeah, I'm I'm not mad. I'm not mad at all. And if you're a content creator, I I just follow my lead, man. It's inexpensive. Hussy, hit me up. I'll help you out. I want to, I want to keep people's voices active. I don't want people to feel silenced. Yeah, the five dollar tier on Patreon. Yes, absolutely. On the uh, the five dollar tier on Patreon, you could still do members only chats and panels. And the ten dollar tier, I, I, I've got to readjust everything. So um, stay tuned. 
YouTube already suspended my account. YouTube is woke tube now, man. I can't believe I had those channels for years, man. Fucking years. I hope I get them back just for the simple fact that I don't want my work to go away. I don't, I don't have a lot of those videos backed up. Well, I do, but it's a pain in the ass, so... Oh, well, fuck it. I'll just have to drag the... Uh, drag the... Hard drives out. Yeah, I'd rather keep all my money anyway. So, fuck them. Fuck them. Uh, Shaquana Jefferson, she claims she is... Uh, she claims that all she is doing is for her your own benefit. And she said she is mentally ill. She knows mania. Guys, she is trying to help. Fuck her. Fucking clown. She's another woke tard. She can eat my fucking... Whatever. What is it Laura said? Corn out of my poop. I can't eat corn, though, because I have diverticulitis, which is something else I've battled this year. Thank you very much. Fucking hater nation, you assholes. Watching your asses gave me diverticulitis. It's ridiculous. Uh, Shaquana, I, I, I've never been to prison, unlike you, so I don't think I'm going to take advice from some fucking former con who uh, is sponging off the government, taking shits and ranting on YouTube. No, they sold me out to the woke mob. Her and Nova did. Fuck them both. I've lost my job now. Imagine if I'd had their back up. If, I, if they'd had my back. Instead of telling me what to do, they had my back pointing out what was wrong that other people were doing. Not pointing out what I was doing. Instead, Nova wants to go play uh, Clap the Cheeks with Frankie. All platforms are woke. Not this one. You can't just come on here and be belligerent. Look, I'm not going to be threatening anybody or doing anything like that, but I'm not going to be fucking... I'm not going to be censored because I want to make some edgy comments. Go fuck yourself. It's comedy. It's comedy. Yeah. It's comedy. What you do, Callie, is you're a fraud, honey, and I'm going to expose you on so many levels. Anybody that wants me to come on panel and talk to them, I don't want any money. I just want to be heard. If anybody needs any info about what's happened over the last year with this community, I got it for you. If anybody needs access to the other people who I, I, I uh, coordinate with and make content with, let me know. I have resources. I don't want them to go to waste. I don't want this to be like, oh, everybody's outraged one day and then tomorrow everybody forgets, right? Because that's the internet for you. Nova is a follower. Well, of course she is. That's what all fucking far left leaning liberals are. They're all followers. They don't know how to speak for themselves. She's a scared little girl who doesn't know how to navigate the world. So she figured, ha, I'm oppressed. I'll blame white people for shit. I love it when white people blame white people for shit. <sighs> Traitors. Yeah, you did. You told me to take a nap in a Xanax, and I said, no, well, I'm good. I knew what I was doing. I was in control. So what? I was made. I'm an entertainer. When am I not manic? Fuck me, dude. I hate it when people, like, analyze my behavior as if they're, why don't you go, hey, Shaquan, why, you were so fit last year to get called a racist for calling Charlie Gold out, but now you're like, uh, uh, uh. What's the matter? You know? Wait, wait, you got, you got smoke Virginia Slims now? I heard that fuck shit, Shaquana, that you, you're black on the inside because of who you grew up around. Spare me. I get it. You can identify, but you, I'd really, no. <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> uh. Go with my gut instincts. Hey, man, I'm feeling, hey, I've had this whole plan. I've had it planned. I feel good now because I feel like the right people have finally seen. And again, if I never go back to YouTube, it's not going to stop me. There's nothing stopping anybody else from taking clips of my work and putting it on a channel for themselves. There's nothing stopping me from signing something with somebody that they start a channel, right? And they just, I feed them clips of my content to mirror on the platform. I'm not allowed to make content on the platform. I'm allowed to appear on the platform. Fuck, I'm a public figure, right? Donald Trump was banned from the platform. He just couldn't use his channels. Didn't mean he couldn't be like, here's a video, right? I hear a grown man. I'm not your mom. I'll wrestle you in a gravel driveway, though. Yeah. 
Yeah, she was dogpiled in 2019, but then she calls me uh, manic for being dogpiled. She can fuck off. I can't believe she was, like, cool up until now. Like, nothing has changed. I, I fucking hate it when people take my situation and try to make themselves look good with it. It's what she did. That's what pisses me off. I don't care what you're trying to say to me. When you do it publicly, like, look, uh, uh, Belinda, Missy, other people, they, they reach out to me privately. And, and I'm quick to either say, and not in so many words, go fuck yourself, or, you know, I'm okay, in other words. Or, uh, yeah, you're right. One of the two. One of the two. And they know either way to just go, okay. <laughs> you know? Because you know? uh, if I, if, if look, if, if I'm, if I say it's good, if I say everything's good, it's good. It's good. And trust me, I have a very flexible scale on what is and what isn't good. Okay? Uh, I haven't been having panic attacks and anxiety. I, I think, I only think I've had one anxiety attack all fucking day. Like, what? I've been having anxiety attacks for the last two weeks, every day. Uh, A week ago, they were like six or seven a day. And it's been happening. I haven't had a single one today. Not a single solitary one. (laughs) So maybe YouTube is just a fucking cancer to me. I don't know, man. I don't know. I just want to get back to entertaining. I want to make good content. I want to be controversial. I want to cover things that you guys want to hear. I want to entertain. And I'm going to do it right here on Rumble. And if I go back to YouTube, fuck it. You know? I, I don't need everybody to like me like Callie. You know? Oh, by the way, guys, go over to Callie Life of a Free Spirits video. <laughs> Let's show you guys. Boy, she get fucking ratioed, didn't you, honey? Look at that. When was the last time you saw numbers like that, hussy? Huh? Holy Jesus, what the fuck did I do? There we go. What was the last time you saw numbers like that? 314 to 146? I haven't seen you have that many dislikes in a long time. It looks like you shit the bed, child. It's only going to get worse from here. Only going to get worse. I have a feeling, anyway. But, you know, don't be afraid to go show Callie some love. She really needs your affirmation, guys. She's a struggling sex worker. So uh, go support the struggling sex worker. Go give her a thumb. I'm not going to tell you what to do because I'm not your daddy. Go show her some love. She really needs the love right now. I don't know when the last time Callie ever had more thumbs down than thumbs up, but, you know. I don't know. Don't do that to her, though, guys, because she's a fragile, fragile one. I don't need the virtue signal because that doesn't put food on my table. But I, I want you to know something. Uh, I want, I'm going to find out where Solomon is. Mm-hmm. And when I do, everybody's going to know. Mm-hmm. Or you could tell us because that's my next mission is to find out where Solomon is and your dad. I'm an investigative journalist, Callie. You can't stop me. That's not a threat. That's not stalking. That's not harassment. It's the truth. So I just want you to know that. Or you could come on for an interview and tell me where Solomon is. You can come on here on my panel and tell me where Solomon is. Uh, links don't work on here. God damn it. Oh, for them to have half the viewers that the gut does. Yeah, right. Yeah. Yeah, Charlie Gold, by the way, is a confirmed YouTuber who uh, went on a targeted hate campaign against a man because of his race, that man being me, and made him lose his money, and they're celebrating taking money away from a disabled child. And yeah, I'm allowed to say that because it's the truth. I mean, this, it's really not even much of a setback. It's just a, it's just an evolution, you know? She could take a poetry award, roll it up real nice and tight, and stick it straight up and flush out the fibroids for all I care. I don't give a fuck. She, 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 uh, I don't know how, she, ta- it's funny because Callie's like, I'm a victim of racism when I'm actually the victim of racism. I'm not going to define myself by that, but if you got, you guys can't overlook that. I am the literal victim of white hate, and it's the truth. 
make you uncomfortable or not, it's the fucking truth. We have to start addressing the fact that you can't treat white people like shit just because some fucking idiot farmer plantation motherfuckers years ago decided to buy some human beings. Okay? Not my fault. I ain't do shit. I ain't done a fucking thing to you. I ain't do a thing then. I ain't done a thing now. Matter of fact, we ain't been here since... We ain't been here but since the late 1800s or something, so... Freedom of press. Thank you, Reaper Girl. Yes. It's the life of a fibroid. Fibroid. Crabroid. But uh, what I'm going to do today is I'm going to... I'm gonna, first, I'm going to go take a cruise. And then I'm going to make out the rest of the week's schedule for content. Because we're not stopping. And we're not going to be beating a dead horse. Because guess who else is still on YouTube? Everybody else. Guess who's still fucking up on YouTube? Everybody else. And guess who's going to review their shit? This guy right here. And Twitch. We're gonna. I'm going to revamp Twitch. We're going to have... What we might do is uh, we're going to have... We're gonna have streams between the two, but uh, I don't know. Let me figure it out. We're gonna we're gonna we're gonna get all this shit. So I mean, like, dude, it's just me. So maybe uh, somebody who's good with this can help me map it out a little bit, or help me create graphics or something. That, I don't know. It, you don't have to. So <laughs> I'm like, <laughs> just me. <laughs> mm-hmm. She got the crap roids, crap roids, yeah, yeah, the crap roids, crap roids, yeah, yeah. I'm doubled over and paid from the crap roids, crap roids. <laughs> Idiot. Uh, how do you know when I go live? Well, subscribe here, and what I'll do is I'll schedule the stream uh, an hour or two out. And what I'll do is I'm going to have a schedule is what I'm going to do. Or I'm going back to a show at 10 and a show at 7. That's what I'm going to do. Nothing changes. It's just different platforms. It's just different platforms. So what we're going to do is I'm going to uh, get a schedule together and I'll just go. And you'll know when I go live and I'll have it set up either the day before promoting it in Discord uh, promoting it on a rumble through a video maybe whatever it may be on Twitch. Yeah, we'll get a schedule. What's up, Bama Josh? What are you doing? Oh, geez. Uh, you know what? This is still pretty new to me, impressive. I've just used this as a dumping ground for all my other videos. Like, I believe Callie's uh, uh, bullshit's on here, which uh, I'm just going to uh, archive. I still have all Callie's lies backed up on my... Uh, uh, Google Drive and they're going to get dumped on a some throwaway channel later that nothing I'm going to profit from just for posterity purposes because she's a very she's proven to be she's proven to be very racist she targeted me because of my skin color her trans boyfriend targeted me because I am a bio male uh, I know that sounds foreign to all of you but that actually is a thing now you know but black people can't hate white people because of the color of their skin, and trans people can't hate a bio male because I have a real penis, and that's what we have here, uh, and that's discrimination, it's bigotry, and it's racism. So I'm treating it as such. I think anybody who else is discriminated against, and they evoke your culture, or they tell you you can't do or say something because of your skin color, you need to tell people to stop being a fucking racist. Remember years ago when white people thought they could just say whatever they wanted to black people because of the color of their skin? That's where we're at now with white people. And it's not all black people, and it's not all white people. It wasn't all white people then. It's not all white people now. You feel me? But it's a problem. I've experienced it. I'm sorry. Let me go through the list again. Charlie Gold, black. Life of a free spirit, black. Shane, trans. Zach, gay. French fry girl, Jewish, <laughs> European, Greek, Egyptian. Yeah. <laughs> Looks like it was made in 2012. <laughs> oh, see, so is it is the aesthetic killing the content for you? Yeah, I know. I know the aesthetic always does it for me. 
So I, I don't see any straight white Christian, Republican, conservative people with children attacking me. What I see are four people who are uh, very woke and SJW-ish trying to protect their investment because Zachary Michael got owned by this straight white male. <laughs> see, I didn't need some phony pronouns to be to, to own you, bro. I don't need phony pronouns to be like, pay attention to me. You're not special. You're not. But there's not a single straight person amongst you that has participated in removing from the platform. I mean, I'm sorry. There's not a straight white person among you that has participated in it. Oh, did that sting? A white guy saying that? You're a racist for saying that. Because I'm allowed to make that observation. If you're allowed to make an observation that Negs likes a, has a thing. You guys have been painting this narrative since February that Negs has a thing for attacking black women. Get the fuck out of here. Yeah, I can still watch YouTube. I'm not banned from watching YouTube. It's a money grab on their end, and it's going to blow up in their face, okay? I want you guys to pay attention to what happens over the next week. I'm not going to do any more streams about this, this incident. If I need to report, like, an update, sure. I got to move on. We got to keep trucking. There's still shit to call out. I can't get distracted by this. It's going to be two days or two weeks. Whatever. Don't care. Keep moving. Can't stop. Won't stop. No, they can't use any of my content because I've been banned from the uh, platform. So any of my content that they flagged to have removed, which was all of it, if they're platforming it, it's a violation of terms of service because I got an email here that said I was I was flagged or something to the effect of that it was over content that had been removed because of terms of service violations. So yes, if they're playing my content, again, they're 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 breaching terms of service as usual. I don't know what the flag it has, don't know. Be creative. Oh, it's not even 24 hours yet, so... Look, it's not even 24 hours. It's been 18 hours. I've already got, what, 300, 300 people here? 320. Um, you know, uh, we're, we're already back in business, so nothing changes. Just, I already had the Twitch empire built. We're going to build this. We're going to get the Twitch built after this. Uh, I mean, post it in the Discord server after this, and we're going to keep fighting. Uh, they shouldn't have done that. Now look, it, and, and I'm not. It's not a threat. They think everything's a threat. It's not a threat. It's a promise. Something's going to happen to one of your channels. It is something is going to happen, and not because of me. I I'm not going to waste time going over and flagging you. I have to keep it pushing. When somebody makes me lose my job, I have to keep it pushing. I'm not like y'all, where I'm going to go to the government and be like, "Give me some money and help me feed my kid." Fuck all that. Fuck the government. Period. What the government's done is they've created a whole generation of, they've created a narc state where people snitch on one another now. Callie is a snitch. She's lucky she lives with all rich white people because they ain't going to give a fuck. Imagine if she got labeled a snitch somewhere where she was in a rougher neighborhood. If she lived where I was and she was labeled a snitch, she cost somebody a job where they made over 50 grand a year. They'd smash every window in her car, key the car, and that's not, this isn't me. They'd probably even kill her cat, honestly, grab it by the tail, smack it up against the tree. People are fucking brutal when you fuck with their families. But you get to hide behind Shane's money and Steve and Michelle's money, right? That must be nice to hide behind rich people's money, Callie. That's going to come back and bite you too, honey. But I am going to go. I'm starting to repeat myself. I don't want to do that over here because, you know, every minute is a dollar. No, it's not. It's not. It's like dial up back in the... In the day, but let's get together tomorrow. I'm taking the rest of the day to just do whatever. It's five o'clock. I'm over it. I'm gonna go vibe on my couch or just something. I don't know. I need to go get some incense. I'm gonna go see my Delta Eight dude and got to monitor my kid because he came in contact with the fucking coof today. Uh, it's been, I lost my job. My kid came in contact with the coof, and I'm just, I'm just. He doesn't have the coof, but he came in contact. It's just a fucking stupid day. It's great to see you guys. Thank you for making this first stream here a success. It is going to be nuked. Um, uh, I'm going to have it on private. I'm probably going to download it and probably put it on a bit shoot or something, but I'm not going to host it here. I want to build this platform, and I want to – I don't have to covet or coddle it like I did on YouTube, but uh, I, I know they're already going to try to fuck with this because they don't want me to feed my kid because they fuck with kids on the Internet like Frankie Crawford. Where's Brandon Lawton at? You guys scrubbed your info off the internet, didn't you? You know I still have it written down, right? 
Mm-hmm. I wrote it down in December when I got it the first time. It didn't go anywhere. You scrubbed it from the internet so nobody else could find it, but I still have it. 